Hello, I'm Gary Guangyu Li, and today I want to talk about AI tables automation. This is the structure of the whole workflow automation about content generation plus automatic posting to Twitter. I will demonstrate the whole path how to build up the workflow automation. Here is the Airtable.ai interface. I created a database and named it as a bulk content generator to X. The database is very simple. First column is idea. You just use the idea quickly to plus the prompt together, post both of them, the data to the ChatGPT. I use the formula here to assemble the first column idea and the second column prompt to make it as an example prompt. How I send it to the ChatGPT? I build the automation here. You can see the first one is a draft the tweet. As long as I click on the, the change the status to the draft the tweet, and then it will send it to the Mac.com by receiving the data from the webhook. And after that, it will start the workflow and post it to the ChatGPT and the ChatGPT will return the draft the tweet here. And the second one is a post a tweet. After that, it will post it to Twitter directly and will return the tweet URL here. So here is the information. Okay, let's back to the make.com part. As long as you get the webhook, you set up the webhook here, and then I use a router here. Okay, because we got two automation, as you seen just now. First automation to send a, is drop a tweet. The second automation is post a tweet. Let's look at the first automation workflow here, because at the beginning, for example, um, I will use these two video as an example to post them to Twitter. This is the first video I want to post to the Twitter. I just copy the title here. You see, it's very easy. And then I will give a check, check the URL. I copy here, extremely simple. I paste it here. So that's it. And then as long as I have already complete the prompt, so I just copy and paste it here and then it's already assembled because I uh, used the formula. Assembled prompt is already here. So I need to post uh, this block content to the chat GPT. I need to use a draft a tweet. How to set up here? Firstly, I use a filter here. The status is a draft a tweet. Then the router will go to this line. The chat GPT, how I set up it? I just use a create a chat completion. And I use the ChatGPT, the latest version here. So I click on it. I just set the user role. And the message content is just choose the assemble prompt. Just run once, for example. You choose this Java tweet, as you can see here. Later, we will see, okay, comes to here. And then, okay, it, it's already succeed. You see, it's already here. Actually, you should put drop the tweet. Yeah, more precisely, drop the tweet here. And then, you just choose here, you save OK. So just now, when I change the status from the blank to the draft the tweet, it will go to this line, and the data will go to the OpenAI, and OpenAI will receive the prompt and generate a prompt, and through this module, update a record, and then return back to the draft the tweet here, to this column, as you can see here. And also the formula I use the land drop the tweet here can give a estimate character. So it should be okay because it's no more than 280. So let's see whether we will still satisfy about this tweet. And you can write check out here. Okay, so now I'm satisfied with the draft the tweet here. So I will go to the next automation. This one, the post the tweet, because I have already set up inside the table part. So I will go back to here to see. Here is filter here. When the status is post a tweet, and then also the tweet is not blank, it exists, the automation should go this line and will post it so far. And then you will update a record here. You will update, update a record here for the URL. This is the last column. But you can also check here. You click on the API. The last column is the update record, uh, AKS. You back to see AKS. So you will combine the default URL here and the tweet ID here to group as a URL. And then you click on OK. So the second automation is also has been set up in the make.com. So this time when I post a tweet, it will finally go to the Twitter. Let's see what happened because we have already set up both of them. Check it. Post a tweet. We will see. Oh, it's already it's already done. Yeah, it's already done. Too fast. We didn't even see the processing flow. Okay. 
we click here, see what happened. Yeah, it's already finally here, you can see. So since both this automation workflow has already been set up, we can do one more workflow to see how it's going. Just now we have post this one. And then this time I will demonstrate how we use this workflow to demonstrate this uh, YouTube video. Okay, it's very easy. I copy the title here and then I copy the link here. Okay, and then I check out at this URL. So it's very easy, right? Every time I just copy the title and then I put the link here and then I copy the prompt I have already set up here. The example prompt will be automatically generated here and then I will change the status to Java tweet and we will see, uh, yeah. Oh, it's already here. And let's see, okay. The character count less than 280 each is okay. Wonderful. And I will post a tweet change it to post it here. and then let's see what happened okay it's done this time let's see it's already posted it will automatically post it to the twitter and return the url here let's click on it yep you see here it's already done exactly same as the the content in the air table Okay, this concludes the share I brought today. Through the video, you can learn how to push to Twitter and finally how to update the link back to Airtable. I have placed the template of the demonstrated Airtable.ai in the description below the video. You can save the template to your space. At the same time, I have also provided some excellent use cases for automation as references. That's it. Goodbye today.